Hey there gamers, probably sent by here and today we have some very exciting things to discuss. First on the agenda is a very exciting tweet from the Disney Dreamlight Valley team giving us our first real look at what to expect in the approaching update. Not only do we have some exciting update reveals, but today is also Wednesday, which means we'll be diving into Dream Snap results our newest Dream Snap challenge, and of course, the Premium Shop Refresh. Before we dive into today's exciting topics, I would like to encourage you to press that like button, as it helps more people discover this channel. Also, consider subscribing for more Disney Dreamlight Valley and gaming content. Now, with that out of the way, let's take our first look at what to expect in the new update. Today, we finally got an official sneak peek at what to expect in the upcoming update. In my opinion, one of the biggest and most important features in this approaching update will be Doors finally returning to Scrooge's shop. This has been a long time bug, and I'm not sure why it took so long for this to get fixed, but as you can see in that top right hand corner, which displays a door within Scrooge's shop, it seems that door skins and variations will finally be making their way back into the game, which is something we haven't seen since the very beginning of early access. Another thing that's important to mention when it comes to doors is that the tweet we received on Monday seemed to hint at doors also being part of the star path. The current lack of door options greatly limits Dreamlight Valley's interior design. And this is something the player base has not been too happy about. So I'm very happy to see that this issue is being addressed in the approaching update. Another interesting thing to note on Dreamlight Valley's Valentine Day tweet is that it seems we have been given confirmation that Celia's snake hairstyle from Monsters Incorporated will be making its way into the star path. So for all of those who guessed or agreed that the woman and snake emoji was a hint towards Celia's hair coming into the star path, congratulations, you got it right. Now the last two pictures in this tweet aren't really anything to get overly excited about. In the top left we have Sully, and on the bottom right we have Mike. With most of us being aware that this approaching update was the Monsters Incorporated update, it's not too surprising to see these two characters being teased. All in all, this is an interesting first sneak peek, and I'm excited to see more of the soon to arrive content. I'd love to hear your thoughts regarding these teasers in the comments below. Next on today's agenda, Dream Snaps. Now, if you watch my weekly Dream Snap series, you know I had some unfortunate circumstances last week. I got a brand new PC and it just kept crashing every two or three minutes into Dreamlight Valley. So I was sincerely unable to put together anything worthwhile. My PC just kept crashing. I did my best to throw together something, but all in all, I spent literally five minutes on this. And I told you guys here on YouTube last week, and I told my chat that I was only expecting maybe 1200 or 1500 Moonstones because I didn't put any effort into this. After all, I couldn't. So as it turns out, I was right about that. We got 50 1500 Moonstones, no big surprise there. This is the submission, and like I said, you know, it's nothing special, so I'm not gonna sit here and pick it apart. I'll show it to you, and I'll tell you the circumstances. If you were here last week, you already know the circumstances. I think that is a fair reward for this. 1500 honestly might be a little bit too much. I mean, I put five minutes into this. I. I feel like that's still, you know, maybe 600 would have been fair, but either way, here we are. Now I was able to get my computer fixed, everything is good now, so don't worry. Next week for the freestyle challenge, I put my usual amount of effort in, and I'm expecting the usual 4,000 Moonstones. I'm excited to share that with you guys next week. Now to discuss this week's brand new Dream Snap Challenge. And with today being Valentine's Day, it seems that the devs were keeping things on theme. This week's challenge is called Minnie Mouse's Festival of Hearts. This is a decor challenge that states, celebrate best friendships and sweethearts in the valley, decorate with cute decor and rosy hues to share the love this week. Mandatory requirements are cute and delicate. Suggested tags will be pink and lavish. Overall, this looks like a cute challenge, and I've already got some fun ideas swirling in my head. 
said. Let me know what you think of this week's Dream Snap Challenge in the comments below. Now let's take a look at this week's Premium Shop Refresh. Unfortunately this week we are once again back to only one page. Maybe that's going to change when the new update drops and we'll always have two pages. I guess we'll have to wait and see. Now we may only have one page but there are some exciting items in the shop. The Sweet House has once again made its return. The coveted Tinker Fairy Wings are back and we have the Art Deco posters. Now all three of these items are great. I definitely recommend each of them if you have a surplus of Moonstones. The only thing I'm not very big on, of course, are umbrellas. I'm just not a big fan of umbrellas. They don't really have any utility. You can't use them in Dream Snaps. As of right now, they really just feel kind of pointless to me. And they're about one of the only things I just don't want to spend Moonstones on. But the rest of these items are great. I especially love the Tinker Fairy Wings. I think there are a lot of fun things you could do with those within Dream Snaps. So if you were going to have to choose one of these to pick up, that I'd probably choose that. The Sweet House would be a close second. But honestly, the Sweet House can be a little bit of a pain to fit into your Valley builds. It just depends on what you've set up. And with that, we've reached the end of today's video. Like I said at the beginning, there are a lot of exciting things going on right now. The late winter update is quickly approaching. And I know, like me, many of you are ready to get your hands on some new content. If you enjoyed today's video, please do me a very big favor and consider pressing that like button. Also, subscribe to the channel for more Disney Dream Light Valley and gaming content. If you would like to catch my content live, you can find me on Twitch, Monday through Saturday. Link below in the video description. As always, thank you so much for your time today, and I hope you enjoy the approaching update.